So I've found a way to make you think I have no clothes hanging over my couch. I just put them over there for the video. It's more aesthetically pleasing for you. You're welcome. I am feeling pretty sleepy, actually. If you're not a part of my everyday life, then you probably don't know this, but I'm really sleepy and tired today because over the past week now, second week, I picked up a, another job, a full-time personal training job, which is really exciting, really awesome, I'm really happy about, and I'm even more happy because the place that I'm at, I'm just excited about it. It's a good thing, it's a really good thing. I'm still full-time bartending right now, so as I'm transitioning, it's just exhausting, closing the bar and then having to be up early in the morning, and I'm trying to adjust to getting up early because I used to go to sleep at 2 a.m., 3 a.m., wake up at 10 a.m., so it's just a transition for my body, so I'm feeling a little sleepy. I only had one cup of coffee today. I'm trying to be good about my caffeine. I'm just gonna get grooving. This is my coffee mug from earlier, so it's a little dirty still, but it is because, you know, Christmas, my Christmas mug. I got this last year, um, I think for like a couple dollars. Thrift Life. I am taking the Alani New Balance supplement. I keep it next to my coffee maker so that I remember to take it every single morning because sometimes I forget. haven't been good with taking my vitamins lately. My life is changing, I'm trying to like, that's the thing I think in this lifestyle is you have to kind of be adaptable and you have to understand that things are going to change, life is going to change and you have to be like open to that and you have to know that and you have to know that like it's okay to change, it's okay to have to change things in your routine, in your life to adapt to how your life is changing so yeah I'm working on that right now. Let me bust out my creamer that I got. For the dark chocolate peppermente because it's delicious. Yeah. yeah. Just wanted to pop on here, say hello, show you my face, let you know I'm still here since I did not post last week. I apologize. It was Thanksgiving and with this new job and transitioning, it's just been a lot. I've been really busy and I'm trying to focus on making sure that I'm taking care of myself because I need to make sure and want to make sure that I am bringing my 100% where it needs to be brought. So I hope you understand that. I'm about to go get some Christmas decorations. I'm so excited to check out the new home goods store that just opened nearby me. I'm getting a car to go. I'm gonna drive over there. I'm getting it for two hours. I'm setting myself on a two hour time limit because I could use three hours of time but I don't want to pay the four hour price. So I'm going to get this done in two hours. There's a Home Goods and a Michaels. So I think I'll be good. I don't even think I'll need to go downtown into Target. I'm hoping and praying that I don't have to because it's just chaos. I'm just assuming that I'm going to find everything that I need in the Home Goods and the Michaels. If you've never seen a car to go before, I just opened it up with my phone. Now I'm gonna grab this key here, and we gonna turn her on, and then we good to go. I was gonna grab that one over there, but like, look how close that car is parked. I was like, nah, I'll take this one across the street. Also, this is how you move the seat forward. Took me forever to figure that out the first time. There she is in all her glory. But, first off, we got my cows. Let's get some ribbon. Alrighty, so I'm home with my tree. Ah! 
it's not situated at all yet. The tree just went up. I have not fixed it because it's crooked. I haven't played with it. The rug's still up. It's a mess. But I'm going to show you where I'm starting. This is where I'm starting here. This is what she looks like. Super slanted. But I'm going to fix that. This is the tree up. I got some pizza and some wine on the bottom of this bag. Okay, so here's the thing. I've decided I'm not letting you know what the theme of my tree is yet, unless I've already told you. But I'm not gonna tell you what my theme is. I'm just gonna show you putting the lights on and like getting the tree situated and everything. But I'm pretty much doing everything tonight as long as I have enough ornaments. I think that I do. The only thing that is making me not able to finish the tree tonight, which is why I'm not going to show you the tree until next week's video, is because I bought a very specific topper like how you would have a star or an angel the star I had from last year does not suffice with this year's theme that topper should be arriving I believe on Wednesday so I'll be able to show you that for next week's video I don't know you might get a little hint with the lights I'm gonna try something new this year with the lights I don't know if I'm gonna like it but I'm gonna try it if I don't like it I'm just gonna take those lights off so I'm gonna have some wine, eat some pizza, decorate my tree, and I'm so excited because this is my absolute favorite part of Christmas. We about to be going crazy with the decorating. So my hair has gotta be out of the way so I can decorate hard. Let me know in the comments down below what you think I'm doing to my tree and what you think this year's theme is. Um, I'm curious to see who's right, if you can guess what it is. If you already know what it is, do not comment what it is. Maybe give a hint, comment a hint. If you already know what it is, leave a comment on a hint, but don't say what it is. I hope you enjoy this, and if you want to see the finished product and what the tree looks like when it's done, don't forget to give next week's video a watch. You can subscribe and hit the notification bell. If you hit the notification bell, then it's gonna bing at you when I post a video and you won't miss it. If you wanna see what my holiday decor currently looks like this year, then leave that in the comments down below and give this video a thumbs up. That way I know, and maybe I'll show you that in my tree video, or we'll just make a new video of its own. Okay, I'm rambling now. Thank you for watching all of this. I hope you enjoy the rest of this video and the beginning stages of decorating the 2019 Christmas tree. Since I burned my mouth on everything, I'm gonna let these babies cool for a little bit. Slowly but surely getting better. Have to make sure that this is the part that I want in the front. Need to see the whole tree for who she is. Sappy hands, who cares? How's it look? I think it looks good. I think it looks straight. She's freaking perfect, man. Yes. So I actually just finished it for real. I took off the lights to like about here on the tree and just completely redid it because I was just not happy with it. I did it too tight so it wasn't loose enough and I couldn't move it around if I needed to or wanted to. But can we just talk about this for a second? How would you feel if you finished your lights exactly where you needed to because let me freaking tell you 
that could not have worked out any more perfect I want to put the other lights on and then I'm gonna see what it looks like and I'm gonna play with it but I just can't get over how beautiful it looks with just the white lights I love the white lights ready for this I have one more strand left and I think it's going to be the perfect amount of lights. I'll show you what it looks like now. Oh my gosh, I can't wait until you see the finished product, but I'm really digging the blue on the inside. I wish that I did the blue first because it just would have been so much easier if I started with that because right now I'm trying to shove it in the inside of the tree and it's going around some of the white lights. So lesson learned for next year, but it looks good. I love it. that's pretty much it for the lights I'm gonna go ahead and just start putting the ribbon on even though the lights aren't perfect and how I want them I learned my lesson to put whatever I'm putting on the inside of the tree on first I didn't really have a plan I didn't really know what I was doing but I learned my lesson this is what we kind of got going on right now it's gonna look so better I think once I put the ribbon on and the ornaments and I can fill in where there's not light so I'm done stressing about it also look at my hands from all the sap they smell delicious though so I'd say worth it so that's it so I am about to put my ribbon on so that's it for this week if you want to see what the ribbon is and what the rest of the tree is then I'll see you next week